chaotic morning of Breaking Brother Farm. Um, today I'm just going to talk about how about 20 different ways that you can make eggs. So if you have an abundance, which hopefully we will have um, come spring and summer when we have our chicks and chickens that we'll be able to use them this way. Mm -hmm. So, number one, scramble them. Yeah, that's easy. Everyone should know how to scramble an egg. Um, two, omelets. Three, you can poach them. Four, bake them. Five, boil them for breakfast, lunches. Um, you can throw them in the Instant Pot. I've seen, um, I haven't tried it yet, but that's just something that maybe we'll do a video on later. Um, you can make the egg muffin cups where you do little easy meals for breakfast or lunch. You take the eggs and you scramble them and you add bacon or spinach, whatever you would like to to your cups, you put them in the muffin tin, you bake them in the oven, um, and then you can put them in the refrigerator and pop them in the microwave the next morning. Um, and that lasts a couple breakfasts. You can do a casserole, which is what I'm currently doing now. I'm doing a sausage, um, egg and cheese casserole. It uses about six eggs. Um, you can fry an egg, number eight, number nine. You can do them over easy. 10. You can do eggs in a basket. I know a lot of people call it different ways, but that's just how I grew up with them. Was eggs in a basket. You take your toast or a piece of bread. You take a measuring cup and cut a hole in the center of it. Put your egg in it and then fry the egg. And then you have an egg and toast together. So then you have number 11, egg salad, 12, deviled eggs. Um, I personally don't like deviled eggs, but I know a lot of people who do. Um, my stepdad, to be more specific, we could never, we had to hide them in a different fridge at Thanksgiving and Christmas, so there would be some for everybody else to eat. Um, and then you have number 12, no, 13, excuse me, um, a quiche, 14, a breakfast quesadilla, 15 egg drop soup. So now you have some options for dinner unless you like doing breakfast for dinner um, 16 an egg sandwich bacon egg and cheese sandwich um, Sausage egg and cheese sandwich however you want to do it um, 17 fried rice uh, That's really good. Just do like one or two eggs. So it's not really using a lot but it does give you an option on how to use some eggs 18 cakes and who doesn't love cakes and brownies? Um, 19, you can freeze them. So you can take your egg pan that you use um, for your egg muffins if you want to do that. And you can um, just open the egg up, put it in there, don't scramble it or anything like that. Pop them in the freezer, freeze them, and then you've got a whole dozen eggs, and then you just lightly thaw them, pull them out to thaw. You can scramble them, bake them, anything you want to do with eggs. Um, and then you have number 20 is a breakfast burrito. You can also give them out to your neighbors, so a bonus 21 neighbors, family, anyone like that. Um, another bonus, 22, you can sell them, but I do know in South Carolina there are different laws and um, things that you have to go around to make sure that your eggs are good to go to other people. I'm just going to finish making my casserole. This is also good uh, for Patrick for breakfast in the mornings. He just cuts it a little bit off and puts it in the microwave. Um, this serves about eight different meals in a 13-inch pan. So, 
you like this video, um, just make sure you like and subscribe. Any comments or any other ways that you have that you like to make eggs, let us know in the comments below. Thanks guys, have a great day.